when we are talking about fibrinoid necrosis this was what was asked in the neat exam so fibrinoid necrosis is going to be characterized by deposition of fibrin like substance which is going to be seen within the vessel wall and why that fibrin is going to get deposited within the vessel wall is because of deposition of immune complexes why will immune complexes get deposited in case when there is an endothelial cell injury so these are the examples so your aim is to crack the exam that's how we remember it where aim is to crack the exam so m for malignant hypertension i for immune complex disease i for immune complex disease and a would stand for something like ashos body a for ashos body now you don't have coagulative necrosis in the pancreas simply because you are having the activation of too many enzymes people too many enzymes are activated and these enzymes are activated within a short span of time so they do not give the time for the coagulation of the proteins which is required for coagulative necrosis right astros body so and examples that you need to remember over here would be vasculitic conditions vasculitic conditions the vasculitic conditions can be associated with the term polyarthritis nodosa or you could be associating it with something like hinox schonlein purpura Thank you.